Hi guys, today's a very exciting day because I'm officially going to be putting on my Sib slide blocks on my skates. I've never done this. Um, I actually haven't even watched a video about this, so maybe I should have. But I want to say that I'm pretty confident at building stuff and putting things together. Um, and it says easy to install, so it's got to be easy for somebody that hasn't done it, right? Right. <laughs> so I'm going to be putting them on. Let me take this off, actually, because I won't be needing that. So I'm going to be putting them on my lollies. These are the pineapple ones. I guess I'll share my little setup. I have the Moxie Fendi wheels. I have a jam plug because I've been practicing. I have derby laces. I think these are just the regular classic ones. I have them in a lavender and a turquoise. Somebody said that they're giving like peep, Easter peeps vibes. And yeah, I think it kind of does. I like pastel, so this is a cute setup for me. And I'm also an Easter baby, so I feel like this is very, very fitting. Let's open this box. These are in a size medium. Here's the sizing for it. If you want to screenshot it, go ahead. They are a size medium. My skates are a size 7. The plate is a size 5. And that is how uh, they narrowed down that I need a size medium. Um, I actually messaged Moxie Roller Skates in the chat thingy because I was really scared that I was going to buy the wrong size. So, do what you got to do. Hopefully, you guys can see me. I'm going to try to like duck down. But if you don't, that's okay. The main focus is putting on the Ziploc. So, let's do it. So, that is, that came out together. Oh, they actually have really good instructions, so I'm excited for that. You know, they're, you know, like the Ikea furniture directions, they're just like pictures. Yeah, that's like, like, okay, but, you know, no words really gets you thinking, you know? Okay. So this is everything that was in. We have the two blocks. Let me see if it focuses. How cute that it's a sib. Uh, so these obviously have to face out, right? I also have this. That is the, it's called the adapter. There's two, there is a silver and there's a black one. Um, that will be interesting. I have this tool. I don't know what it's for yet, but we will find out. And I have like washers and bolts in here and some little um, little tools. I love that it's sealed because you don't want to like lose anything. So let's get into it. Okay, so first it says... So Oh, this is confusing. Um, okay, let's, uh, I guess, get into it. Let's get my computer because, so I do have to find out which size of this I need. They honestly look the same. Except this is a little bit curvier. It's what I think I need to use because I have a curve. So now these are the ones that I'm going to be using. So that's awesome. Let's see. This is for that one, this is for this one then, right? And then this one would be for this one. Okay, so then we're going to open up these. If it's telling me that I need... I'll just lay it out here. To make sure everything is clear. Have a total of four of these black bolts. Have a total of four of these nuts, I think they're called. I have one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight washers. 
which I know two are going to be used for each of this one right now that I'm going to install this. And then I'll have four on the side. I'm going to use this on this and two on these. I'm going to pretty much set up the sit block. Um, for the top part, I'm going to use two washers and two bolts. Let's put those on. And on. And we're just going to put it in. It looks like it's like this, though, so... I'm just gonna go ahead and go ahead and let's see if it works, you know? Simple, I think. We're gonna use this little tool to tighten them up. Well, not tighten them up, but pretty much get it to go all the way down because it does get stuck for a moment. On the other end, we're gonna do another washer in one of these bolts. So, flip it upside down. In like that. I don't think I have a tool for uh tightening down the um the little one. I lost my white tool, so that kind of sucks. And by loss, I mean I forgot it at a park. So I do see why you need a white tool. Okay, I don't know if I'll be able to do this without my white tool because. It's jiggling. Well, I've come to the conclusion that I can't use this for um, installing them because I had to get in here and it sounds like only a white tool can do that. I'm really sad because I have to go buy one now. So, we're going to go... Blah, 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 blah. We're gonna go take a trip. We are at the skate shop. I'm gonna get a white tool so we can get back to installing my side blocks. I kind of was dreading. I didn't want to come out because I really wanted to just put them on, but there was no way without it. So let's go. <laughs> we got the tool. Well, I got the tool. Oh my God, the big trash can uh, truck scared me. <laughs> got the white three tool now. Now, let's go install my sim blocks finally. And we're back. And I have a new white tool, white three tool. Um, yeah, this is what I needed. So let's open it. So I actually had one, but I ended up leaving it at the park one time by mistake, okay? And I didn't realize until after I was looking at pictures that I took. Ow, that hurt. Um, <laughs> that my tool was on on the grass. It was in one of the pictures. It was blended in with the grass, and <laughs> that was that. Um, yeah, that's how I lost my tool. Back to this, sorry guys. I'm to install this really quick. I guess this is how it's gonna happen. So I'm actually using the white three tool to hold the nut on the other side. Then the uh, wrench, I think that's what's called, I'm gonna put it in there. And pretty much I'm holding onto the white three tool like this and I'm just twisting it. Like oh. You don't get shakiness. <laughs> Now it's time to put them in my skate. You want the lettering mark to be facing out. This part, the openness, is gonna be on the back wheels. I've never done this to my skate, so I'm a little bit nervous, not gonna lie. But we're gonna, we have to set it, we take it apart pretty much. So this is how they're going to go in here and pretty much you're putting everything back the way you took it out so let's do it. <laughs> And so 
focus. <laughs> Yay! I put in my first zip lock. Okay, let's pop in the wheels really quick. I want to see the whole setup already. Look at them. How cute! Yes. Okay. Let me do the other one. And we will get back when they're both on. Guys. I would love to show you guys my lollies with zip locks. I don't know if you can see the sip on it. Here they are. I'm so excited. Okay, let's talk about it. <sighs> Installing them was not difficult. You definitely need a Y3 tool because that's like on the first part of the sip blocks. This comes in handy. The, this kind of tool won't help you at all. I tried it. You get two pairs. Uh, the black one's obviously for the lolly because it has a little curve and this will be for probably a flatter skate. So save them. You're going to get your hands dirty. Just an FYI. You are going to set, like take your skate apart. So be ready to do that. Literally, you're taking everything away from the plate because your zip lock is the first thing that's gonna attach. So be ready for that. I did one of my skates that I took off the wheels and then I did the other one that I didn't take off the wheels when I was installing them. So I don't know, these are also pretty small wheels. So maybe depending, but you might not need to uh, take off the wheels These are my uh, Park skates going forward. I am going to change my jam plug into my Daisy toe stoppers Everything here in my skate other than the jam plugs Everything I purchased with my own money on moxieskates.com. It was not sponsored I do have an affiliate link with them though, and I'll tag it below. But it pre pretty much, if you are planning to purchase from Moxy Roller Skates or Moxy Skates, you can use my code SKATINGBB and you're gonna get some money off your purchase. Again, it is an affiliate code, so I appreciate all the support and love, but I also am happy that I can offer a discount code because we need discounts. <laughs> Especially for skate stuff, like skating is not cheap. This is definitely not a cheap hobby. <sighs> it's one of the best things ever though, so it's so worth it, but still. It's expensive out here. Um, well, I'm going to go try them out. I won't film, but thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for... <laughs> being here and i hope this helped for anybody that is installing new zip locks it is okay to not know you can watch other youtube videos and you will you know probably get an idea of it but i'm so excited and yeah i will uh give my review later on maybe or maybe not it depends but yeah, thank you guys for watching and I hope you have a great day.